Hi everyone, I'm back with another tutorial. This one is a green halo eye and um, green's like my favorite color so I just wanted to do a look at that incorporated green. So um, if you like it, keep watching and I hope you enjoy. Thanks. Alright, so I'm starting with my base all done. My foundation, my blush, my bronzer, my brows. Um, yeah, so uh, let's just get started with the eyes. The first shade I'm going to be using is Peach Smoothie by Makeup Geek and I'm going in with a Sigma E40 blending brush and I'm just going to put this all over the crease from the outer corner to the inner corner as my transition shade. Next I'm going in with this color taupe from the Lorac Pro Palette with this uh, no name brush I got, I don't know where from where, but it's a smaller kind of brush to put color in specific areas. And so my specific areas are going to be the outer corner and the inner corner, leaving the center bare. And then I'm going to connect the two colors from the inner and outer uh, at the lower part of the crease, still leaving the lid, so the center of the lid um, bare. And then I'm just going to go in with a smaller blending brush from Crown to blend it all out. Next I'm going to take a more precise um, dome brush, it's also a no-name brush, sorry guys. And I'm going to be taking the color Sable from the Lorac Pro palette and I'm going to be focusing this uh, a little bit further out and a little bit further in on the eyelid. And then we're going to do a little more blending. And then to define it just a little skosh more, I'm going in with the color Espresso from the Lorac Pro palette with a Sigma E30 pencil brush. And of course, blend, blend, blend. And for the center of the lid, I'm going to go in with this mineral eyeshadow from um, Color Revolution. Um, and the color is called Aspen Tree. It's this nice green color. Very shimmery green, like a forest green, I'd say. And I'm going to pick that up with a MAC 242 brush. So I dusted off this little dome brush and I'm just going to slightly try to blend these edges together. And then to make it pop a little bit more, I think I'm going to put a little bit of this Makeup Geek Shimmer Shimmer um, on the very center uh, just to give it a little more brightness with the, my ring finger. I definitely lightened the green up a little bit. And then I'm going to be taking this MAC 239 brush and then a little bit of the white from Lorac Pro palette and put it on the uh, brow bone. For the lower lash line, I'm going to go in with an e.l.f. smudge brush and I'm going to take a little bit of the sable from the Lorac Pro palette. Just smudge it under. And then I'm going to go in with this Sigma Blending E25 and I think I'm going to mix some of the cream and the taupe together and then just further blend the bottom lash line out. So now I'm going to curl my lashes and apply some mascara and I'm going to use the Full Lash Bloom Cover Girl. And for lashes today, I decided to go a little more bold. I'm going to be using Cocoa Lashes in the style Cocoa. Holy moly, these are crazy. Cuckoo, so uh, 
while they are drying, I'm going to put my lipstick on. I'm going to go in with this Lorac lipstick, uh, unintentional, in the color Duchess first. I'm going to go in with Kimchi Doll from Gerard Cosmetics on top. This is the finished look. So if you watched through this whole tutorial, thank you very much. And I hope that you were inspired in some way or you learned something or just uh, were entertained. So um, yeah, uh, hopefully I'll be back with another tutorial soon and I will see you then next time. Bye. trying to get a good angle for a picture. <laughs> I'm really bad at taking pictures. Mm. So I just want to say, actually, I don't know. <laughs> and blah, 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 blah. Hi everyone, I'm back with another tutorial. I hate that. All finished off. That would be freaking awesome. <laughs> okay, everyone. What? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay. Okay. I don't even know what to do. And a little bit of this white from the Lorac Pro Palette. And a little bit of the white from the Lorac Pro... Really? Really? Ooh. I am not in a filming mood today, I think. I'm off a little bit. I feel off. Ugh. I don't know. That's so weird. Okay. I need to be done. I need to be done. And I'm out. Because I'm done.